Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. My name is Dustin. I am a subject matter expert in the systems management space. Today, I will be going over jobs and logs using Dell Repository Manager. So first, let's start talking about jobs. So jobs are gonna be listed under the DRM dropdown. That's this dropdown here. And then you literally just click jobs here. So once we've done an action, we can come in here and see basically what happened with that action, right? And the easiest way to do that is just to go in here, find your action, let's say catalog update, for example. And we're just going to click show log. So this is gonna give you uh, detailed troubleshooting information for the specific job. And as we can see, there's a good amount of info in here. It'll tell you the location it's downloading from, where it's downloading to, uh, et cetera. So if we actually start at the beginning of the stream, you can see that it was able to update. It's trying to update one catalog. It's the enterprise catalog it's trying to update. It's trying to update it from this version to this version. So 2600 to 26001. And that's basically all the information you're gonna get. And the same thing will change on different uh, options. So for this one, we made a smart bootable ISO. We can see that it came from this folder on downloads.com or on mine and it was copied to this folder into the store. And that tells you what failed, what didn't fail, where you're putting it. In this case, it was creating an ISO. So it's pretty simple, but it's definitely a good spot to start whenever you've done an action in Dell Repository Manager and either it didn't do what you said or you wanna just go see kind of exactly what it did. So now let's suppose you've done all that and you need to go even further. Now we really need to scrub uh, some actual logs. Let's suppose that we're going to escalate to SST or engineering or whatever. Um, we're always going to want to pull the logs from the log section. So save and email logs. That's the area where we'll go. And from here, you can either configure email settings and email it, or you can just directly download it. And when you download it, what's going to happen is you're going to get a logs folder and you can save it wherever. What's good about this is that it, log, it, it gets everything. So it puts everything in what's called a DRM service log. Um, it does rotate and save previous copies of those logs. But whenever you do it this way, you get the entire log directory zipped instead of just one of the logs. So it definitely helps and makes it easier. So once that's saved, to go figure out where it went. So we'll go ahead and extract all these just so we can see them. And these are the main ones we're looking for, for, uh, for specifically our case. So let's just do date modified. This is the latest one that hasn't been rolled up into a log. All right, so from here, looking at the logs, one of the things I like to do is immediately go to the end, control end, because usually what you just did is recent, right? So for example, this is doing a, an update, right? So it's trying to see what we have for the catalog. So downloads.all.com slash catalog, that's where it's getting it. It's checking our version. This is basically checking if we want to update um, the actual DRM, right? And that's pretty much it. So the idea is you're gonna to wanna to follow, start with the beginning and follow that task all the way down to figure out either where it's erring on or what issue you're having. So that's really it. The biggest thing is to remember to pull these logs whenever you have to escalate and try to look through them first and see if maybe you can figure out what's going on. Um, see if you figure out issues with proxy or if you figure out what's going on with the current catalog. For instance, in here, when I did my update, there's no catalog update. So that's what's going on. It can't find the catalog either because it doesn't exist or it's already at the latest. 
So that's it. I hope you all enjoyed my uh, video going over logs and jobs. So thank you and have a great day.